Hi there folks, Dr. Matt Hobson from the University of Leicester here. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to import uh, the base map from the Ancient World Mapping Centre uh, into QGIS 3 so you can use that as a base map for any maps or distributions of your data that you want to make. Now this is quite easy in QGIS 3. Um, all we need to do is in the browser panel go down to this XYZ tiles right click on it and then left click new connection in order to connect an ancient world mapping center base map tiles you'll need the following URL so I'm gonna copy that and paste it uh, sorry paste it in the URL box and I'm going to give it a name AWMC for Ancient World Mapping Center and you'll see here at the end of this URL where I've written enter your map box token here we're going to delete that and what you need to do is go to www.mapbox.com, click on the Get Started for Free button, and register with a username, email address, and password for an account. And then once you've registered with Mapbox, they'll give you what they call a token, which is a, a series of letters and numbers. I've already registered previously, so then I'm going to copy the token which I've got from Mapbox into the end of that URL which I was writing there. Just paste it in like that. And then click OK. And then if we go back to our QJS window, all you have to do is simply uh, double click the Angel World Mapping Center layer and you can see that the base map loads and you've got different levels of detail for different zoom levels if we zoom in here on uh, ancient Carthage and we turn our Google satellite layer on we can see that the coastline alters from the modern day coastline with Google Satellite to the ancient World Mapping Center's uh, estimated coastline. Okay, so very useful for making ancient maps or maps of your data. Um, hope you uh, enjoy using it. Thanks very much for listening.